This video is in response to a question by mathematician James Prop. He asks, how do you do division in a base 3 to 2 machine? Hey guys, Gorf here, and today we're going to be discussing why it is so hard that it's nearly impossible to do division in a base 3 to 2 machine and how to get around that. Alright, so here we have the weird machine that has twisted our imagination for so long and it's time to well try to define it. It looks simple. Shouldn't be too hard, right? Well, let's see. Seven here. So we're gonna divide seven by five. How about that? Let's do our explosions. 32, 32, 32, 32. Okay, we're gonna look for this pattern in this. So we're gonna have to unexplode some. Two goes to three. All right, we still don't have any. Two goes to three. Uh, I need there. And, well, yippee, we found one. All right, let's continue. Two goes to three, nothing. Two goes to three, uh, nothing. Two goes to three, nothing. I'm starting to sense a pattern here. This is the problem because we got stuck in an infinite hit series. Oh wait, that's a YouTube channel. You can't do the division because it's impossible to find the pattern now. Since we just keep going back, go, doing the exact same problem over and over again. And it, it doesn't seem to be getting us anywhere. So let's try to find a way around this. All right, so, so we're in, in a strange machine, it's two dimensional. If you haven't seen this, we have a video on it. Uh, just click the 12 box to go to it. You may already see the base 32 machine. It's right along the diagonal. All right, so here's how it works. Three go, one goes, I mean, three goes to one in the base three machine right here. And then one goes to two by unexploding in the base two machine. As you can see, we just did a three goes to two. So now, up, that, 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 that. we have seven dots. So let's set up what we had before. So this equals seven. All right, now we need to find Ah. We need to find these in it. Here are the five patterns we're looking for. So, we know how to find the first one. Let's find it. Alright, once, twice, and got it. Now, it's time for us to show how this machine allows us to do this. All right, so here's how we can get around this. So, before we would do a two, two, three, expo an explosion, and then another one, then we would end up in a place like this and we would get stuck. But now that we we can unexplode these and get something pretty cool. Let's unexplode the this. Going three. I mean going one to three. And now we can do this again. Turn it into a nine. All 
All right, now that we have this, we can walk it up. And with two to one explosions. And we have another pattern for us. Okay, this is great. And we can continue with this process, moving them to the side and up, and so that we never end up running out of space. Well, we never get into, so we never get stuck. So you'll have an infinite sequence? Yes. All right, so that's all we have time for. Not really, but that's all we're gonna do. And bye guys, or anyone who's watching. Music from this video comes from Ben's sound.